please comment below and don't forget to share this video. The original gripper is an incredibly advanced push block, but would you believe it could get even more advanced? Seems unbelievable, but believe it. What makes the GR200 so advanced? Thought you'd never ask. It's the same as the original model, but it includes two additional accessories for more functionality, safety, and control. No other push block delivers this level of safety and versatility. It gives you three directions of control to prevent kickback and protect your hands from spinning blades. The powerful green grip on its adjustable legs controls your workpiece on both sides of the blade, giving you clean, effortless cuts. The adjustable spacer gives you more control by adding an extra inch of green grip to your gripper, and an extra inch of ripping capacity. Use it on the joiner for more traction when face joining. You can also use it on the bandsaw for better traction and a more comfortable grip when resawing material. Use it on the router table to protect your hands from exposed bits or for better control when freehand routing. Next up, we have the stabilizing plate. The stabilizing plate gives you another point of contact to better stabilize your material. It acts like a dynamic feather board, keeping the material parallel to the blade without applying unnecessary pressure into the blade. It also features a hook to help push small parts through the cut. That means more control and less burning in blade marks. If you have the original gripper and you want to get more advanced, I have good news for you. We offer an upgrade kit to turn your GR100 into a GR200 without having to buy the whole kit and caboodle. You're welcome. Make your woodworking more advanced with the GR200 Advanced Push Block. Visit us online at microjig.com to order yours today or to find a retailer near you. Microjig. Work safer. Work smarter. Looking for a cordless circular saw that combines brushless motor technology with battery innovation? Introducing the world's first cordless 7 and 1 quarter inch rear handle circular saw. It's powered by two 18 volt lithium ion batteries, so you get 36 volts of power and runtime, but without leaving the 18 volt battery platform. The helical gear system is engineered for better transmission efficiency over current gear styles. With no oil needed and no brushes to replace, that means easy maintenance for you. The Makita-built electronically controlled brushless motor delivers up to 5100 RPM for efficient cutting. This new original delivers. It can make up to 558 cross cuts in 2x4 lumber on a single charge. This saw can cut a 3x in a single pass with a full 2 and 9 16 inch cutting capacity. It also has soft start and an electric brake for maximum productivity. The saw has a die cast magnesium base and blade guard which combines durability with less weight. For the most demanding cuts, automatic speed change technology goes to work. This automatically adjusts the speed and torque under load for optimum cutting performance. Uh, we're here in Seattle, Washington, uh, getting ready to start uh, a big research facility. Uh, today we're uh, preparing to, to create a duct bank to, to run some temporary power through. It's surprising to have a battery powered saw that doesn't bog down. It, it, 
the cut's really clean, it's fast, uh, there's no, no boggy feeling at all, there's no um, awkward jam feelings that you get as you're running it. Uncanning how well it performs. I liked it, I liked the saw. The fact that it's easy to get your, your hand on and two hands on the saw for better control. It was great, I love the power of the saw. It's lightweight, perfect for what I do. This is a great feature, tether it right here, you've got the setup so you don't drop the saw over the edge. I cut everything with a new saw, you know, it's really nice, really comfortable. Everything is good, the power is really nice, you know. Control is exactly what you need. Easy, easy. I buy it, it's sweet. It's very cool, and very comfortable, and this is good, very strong. Perfect. The saw features extreme protection technology, engineered for increased dust and water resistance for operation in harsh job site conditions. It's compatible with Makita 18 volt lithium ion batteries with the fastest charge times in their categories. Makita lithium ion tools, batteries and chargers are backed by a three year limited warranty. Without uh, cords, it's it's almost like you have to retrain your brain to know that there's not a cord there because so much of your cutting process when you're making long rips have to do with where your, where your cord is. Equipped with star protection, communication technology between the tool and battery that protects against overload, over discharge, and overheating. It's part of the Makita 18 volt series, the world's largest 18 volt lithium ion cordless tool lineup. One LXT system compatible with over 150 solutions. The mobile drilling aid from Wolfcraft is ideal for drilling on smooth surfaces. The rubber feet will ensure the drilling aid secure stand while the positioning lines allow precise drilling. Thanks to the integrated V-groove, it is very easy to drill into round timber and tubes. Also, right angle drilling is no longer a problem. The mobile drilling aid, ideal for all cordless screwdrivers and power drills without collar. For right angle drilling in a fast and easy way with best results. I'm Jim Heavey from Wood Magazine, and we're here at IWF 2012. Talk to Brian Latimer a little bit about the Nova 2 Comet MIDI laser. Well, right. I noticed something very unique about this almost right away. All right. And that's at the head end of this stock. All right. Tell yeah. me a little bit about this. Well, the absolute standout feature of this lathe is we've designed a, a Nova Versaturn coupler system. Okay. And basically, it's for mounting all sorts of accessory uh, accessories on here to turn it into a multi-work center. So you've got your own grinding wheel, you've got a wire brush, you've got a whetstone, you've got a flexible drive you can put on, a whole lot of accessories you can put on here to turn it into um, a, a workstation that you can use for a lot of different operations. Um, a lot of those, of course, would aid your turning work, like you can, with a flexible drive, you could have a power carver on it. Mm -hmm. And it's not just any old power carver, it's driven by a three-quarter horsepower DC motor. So it's a quite a powerful, quite a powerful... Well, I thought was interesting is having a grinding wheel on here, so while you're working, if you notice that your, your skew chisel needs a little bit of an edge put on it, you can walk right over, right next to the lathe, put that edge back on it, and go right back to your turning again. Exactly. Just show me how that goes on. And this is what I was talking about. So now you add there your grinding just, stone. I mean, so that's 10 seconds exactly, worth of, uh, exactly. So it's really simple to put on and take off. It gives you a grinding wheel that is a variable speed exactly, grinding wheel. So exactly. you can slow it right down to the exact speed you want. Mm -hmm. So it means also on your wet stone, you can really slow that down. Oh yeah, you can slow it down, Which down to want. a creep if mm -hmm. you wanted to do that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Very okay. nice. It's got a three-quarter horsepower DC motor, very, very powerful motor on it. It's got a three-speed range, and you can take it from 250 RPM right up to 4,000 RPM. Oh, this is reversible. And yes, it's reversible. That's a, a very uh, nice feature. Here it is here, and you can just put it into reverse. Uh, obviously, it, it won't 
it won't automatically go into reverse. It'll 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 cut off. The switch cuts off before you, so you can't accidentally okay. put it in reverse. Mm -hmm. A good feature. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> um, so yeah, very few MIDI lathes have got a reversing feature. It's excellent for sanding. It takes all the sanding and you know, all the sanding dust away from you. It's it's really keep, keeps all the grain down. It's a really good feature for um, any sanding operations. Okay. That, that sort of operation you need. So, um, and it's very easily done. As I say, very few MIDI lathes have got that feature. So it's, if you look at every single um, part of the lathe, it's very well featured. It's got everything you need in a MIDI lathe, basically.